This is HP Omen 17 inch laptop. When I turn on, it doesn't show anything on the screen except some vertical lines in there. So we're going to check this out. And then when I connect any external monitor through HDMI cable, all seems fine. Okay. Which indicates the problem is the actual screen or the screen connector, one of them. Okay. The actual main board is absolutely fine. There is no issue. Otherwise, it is not going to show any secondary display into the separate monitor. So as you can see, there are a lot of vertical lines in there. And also the face tracking shows it's trying to get the face ID to work. Okay. So let's connect a HDMI cable to my separate monitor to see if anything comes up to the screen. As you can see, the screen comes on. So we're going to replace the screen today and check if this is, if this does work. By the way, this one takes 17 inch 40 pin connector screen. To replace the screen, especially for gaming laptop, is sometimes tricky. The reason is to get the right part, first of all. And then second one to have the right tools to perform this replacement and the third one to follow the safety precautions and everything okay you know before any laptops you'd able to take out the battery from outside but nowadays all the laptops almost 99.99 percent laptops the actual battery is internal okay so when you try to replace any screen the thing is you need to disconnect the 40 pin connectors display connector which is really fine compact in size and very easy to get damage if you don't re disconnect the battery first okay that could be shorted the motherboard to the ground and it would be completely wasted you know so the first thing the right procedure to replace the screen disconnect the battery does no matter if there is any charge or not charge and that's why we're going to take out the back cover and once the back cover removed we're going to disconnect the battery connector first then we are good to go. We're going to take the front bezels out. This model is a little bit tricky. The reason is the actual front bezel placed with strong adhesive underneath. So you have to be very careful when you pull those out. Okay. Uh, especially the plastic, front plastic is quite dry and very easy to get damage. I mean break. So follow the steps. Check the video first from first to last and then you'd have a basic idea how to replace it and then you can play up your mind and do that. Okay. So to get the right part, sometimes when you search with the model number, I mean the base model number of this product, for example, this is HP Omen 17-AN019, whatever. If you search in that way, it's always going to show you it's available but the price would be quite high there is the another way that you can reduce the price so what you have to do pull out this old screen and check the model number of this screen which printed back of this screen okay and also you can check there is 30 pin or 40 pin this is the correct way to get the replacement because i found myself most of the time when i produce this sort of video everybody keep asking almost everyone like hey where can i get the part okay so this is the thing if you want to get the part does no matter which country you are in especially if you are europe usa canada uh you know anywhere try to search with the actual base model number of this screen okay because sometimes the same screen could be used in many different laptops that could be in hp that could be in asa dell any different cross brand okay so these are the things so video will be a little bit longer you know accept it and then follow the steps you'd be able to do this replacement without visiting any shop and then i'm going to charge you plenty of money it doesn't